Let me show you how to make easy begiwi, also known as bean soup. At this point, you can also add pepper to your beans puree, but because I'll be eating this begiri with real peppered stew, then I will not be adding pepper. But if you are eating the begiri soup on its own, you have to add some pepper. Now, um, something you must know, right? Apart from mixing the, the three that stew, begiri and the wedu, you can also eat bean soup on its own. You can add your meat stock, meat, fish, everything you want in it. Okay, then this is done. A little bit of that goat meat stock. Thing. Something that should go in next is blended crayfish. Now that is our bakery. It's actually ready because the beans is done, the oil has been mixing. So I'll just give it like another two minutes, stirring from time to time. Now to adjust the taste, I need to taste first to see how. This is good. Remember, we still have stew. We still have the way by the side. So just make sure that we um, season them all appropriately so that when they come together, it will be a taste wonder. Yeah? Then you will now enjoy this with chill Coca Cola. This is fantastic.
Test it and let me know what you think. Wow. Honestly. It's sumptuous. <laughs> I know I deserve it. <laughs> That refreshing sound. Yes. Nice Cheese cook. <laughs> And the begging is yeah, so on point. That is what really makes it abula. Yeah, thank you. There's Ab no abula without begging. Yeah, thank you so much, guys. Like this is well, so nice. I would say this is the Yoruba delicacy, especially those from Ibadan, mm -hmm. especially. Yeah, this the is a delicacy. The first time I ever um, saw abula was in Ibadan. I cannot exactly. go to Ibadan without visiting one of the restaurants. Mm -hmm. I must have this. If you like this video, please give me a thumb up, share and comment. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, do click on the subscribe button and notification bell to enjoy more of my recipes.